Hello YouTube, you're watching Daily Dinkus. It is January 6th, and I'm in Agra, India, home of the Taj Mahal, and also home to a lot of very spiritual and religious people. It's about 6 in the morning, and the sounds you hear behind me are, I believe, the sounds of people praying. <laughs> and that is perfect, because today is Take a Poet to Lunch Date, and I had an epiphany. These guys are poets. Oh yeah, make no mistake, they're poets of the sort. And my plan today is to find some kind of holy man, a swami, a guru, a yogi, I don't know, maybe one of those guys that, you know, walks like this and hasn't eaten breakfast since 1922 and sits on top of a pole 22 hours a day. I don't know, and that's my plan. Get one of these guys for lunch. Probably won't speak English, which will be even funnier. Anyway, I'm not sure I can pull this off. Wish me luck. Well, let's go and see what happens. I just realized I may have a problem. What if I take one of these guys for lunch and it kills him? Because he hasn't eaten for 20 years. Like a vegetarian who starts eating meat again and his stomach explodes. I don't want blood on my hands. I gotta do some homework before I pursue this any further. Okay, so I'm back in my $3 hotel, breakfast included. And uh, I've done some homework and apparently the stories you hear about these gurus and swamis not eating for years is a bunch of bollocks. Moreover, even if they haven't eaten for an extended period, feeding them will not kill them. It may make them violently ill, but will not kill them, so I think we're good to go. So I'm on my way to the Taj Mahal, and I have to say, if poems could be written with honking horns, Indians would be the masters of poetry. You cannot go, in fact, this is probably a world record. I've gone, what, 10 seconds? Well, about 10 seconds without a honk. Usually it's just non-stop. So I got a little sidelined on my way to the Taj Mahal and ended up here at Agri University. Yes, this is actually an Indian university. Anyway, as I was wandering around exploring, a couple guys on a motorcycle came up to me and they asked me what I was doing here and I said, well, I'm a YouTuber, I'm visiting. And they said, YouTuber, can we be in one of your videos? And I said, well, probably not unless, are you a poet? And this guy on the motorcycle said, yes, he's a poet. And I thought, well, maybe I could take these guys to lunch, but I think they need to earn it. They need to earn a spot in one of my videos. How, I'm in India, I'm looking for something poetic. How could these guys earn a spot in one of my videos? So we're composing a poem, and my man here is improvising. He's actually into it. What are you, what are you doing here? You should be ready. Okay, tell me. Tell me. So you should ready yes. to, to listen to me. You should be ready to listen to me and watch Daily Dinkus on TV. That's my advice. Nothing is more beautiful. Okay, he has a different idea, which is probably better. You watch Dinkus Daily TV. Daily Dinkus. Daily Dinkus. Oh, sorry. Watch Daily Dinkus on TV. Okay, okay. Amazing, here we go. Yes. Hi. Hello, Hi. YouTube. Hello. Okay, guys. We are, um, are poets. No, no, am I poet? Sabe, am I poet? Sabe, am I poet? Uh, uh, everyone uh, on self, yourself, poet. Yes. Okay, okay. okay. Are you ready? I am a poet, didn't even know it that time for exam crutch, but I am hungry. And I need some lunch. So I am going to spread my words for you. Listen, because my words are true. So you should read to listen to me and watch Daily Tinkers on TV. Let's see. Yeah, hey. that's it, guys. Yes, you are all poets. Thank you so much. Yes. So here I am with my, my group of Indian poets. Right on, guys. 
Yo, 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 yo. And I guess that's it, guys. Uh, yeah. Till next time, happy take a poet to lunch day. Um, yeah, I guess yeah, I hope you yeah, take yeah, a poet yeah, to lunch. Let's see, yeah. let's see sounding your name. Uh, okay. Daily Dinkas. Yes, Daily Dinkas. Dinkas. So next time you're watching. Daily Dinkas. Bye now. So these guys don't really want to go for lunch. So I'm going to do okay. the next best thing. I'm going to share an orange with you. Oh. This is lunch. <laughs> I'm going to take you to lunch. Energetic, right over here. energetic lunch. Energetic yes, lunch. energetic orange lunch. Healthy lunch. You like oranges? Yes, 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 yes an orange is lunch. All right, guys, let's, let's go for lunch right over here. I'm taking you for lunch. Come here. This is lunch for five people, so. Nice to meet you. Are you a poet as well? Uh, are you a poet? Yeah. You're a poet. You are a poet. Uh, not He's a poet too. Uh, uh, yeah. Tell me, tell me, tell me a poem. Koi diman kehta hai, koi pagal samjhta hai. That rhymed, except the same word twice, so it's a little cheating. Magar dharti ki bechani to sirf baadal samjhta hai. Okay. Lunch, lunch, lunch. All right. Lunch, lunch, everybody! Lunch is served! Lunch is served! Lunch is served, yes! Lunch is served, thank you! Lunch. It's mine! Lunch. It's mine! Lunch! It's a little minimalistic lunch, but it, it's very healthy, yes? Yes. Now we are full. Now we are full. You're full! Thank you. You're lying, but you're very polite. So I have one thing to say. You have you. I have one thing to say. Listen. Listen, 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 listen. listen. Yes. For your exams, it's me you should consult. Have a healthy lunch for the best result. Yes. Okay? Okay. That's my poem for you. Good luck with exams. Have a healthy Thank lunch. You. For your exams. Can I of course. Yes, Go ahead. Uh, your energetic lunch will be helping exams for us. I hope so. I will pray for you. I will channel the spirit of Shiva. To create some great exam marks for you. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right, guys. We are a student of Master of Social Work. You are. Oh, yes. fantastic. All of us, Master of Social Work. Oh, excellent. Don't I'm sure you'll be fantastic social workers. Yes. Thank yeah. you so much. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Cheers. By the way, I have to make a mental note to ask this guy about toilet paper. What they say about India is true. There is no toilet paper anywhere. Even the hotels don't stock it in the bathrooms. What is going on? Maybe it is because nobody here eats. I don't know. This is toilet paper I brought from Thailand. I'm down to my last couple squares and I'm quite concerned. Anyway, maybe I should bring some toilet paper for this guru that I take to lunch because if he hasn't eaten in a while, he may have a problem that he's unfamiliar with.